Hey guys, this is Khadeen and you are watching Grow with Khadeen. In this video, you are going to learn that how you can use multiple social accounts in one browser session. Let's suppose you have a single browser and in, in, multi, in uh, different tabs, you can use different uh, social media or any other accounts. Like in this tab, you have one account signed in and in this tab, you have an other account signed in. And uh, as an affiliate marketer, digital marketer or anyone else, I'll tell, I'll tell you use cases, but if you are any professional, you must use this. Uh, you must watch this tutorial uh, and uh, use this technique to use multiple social media accounts. So let's just get so to do that, what you just have to do is you just have to go to link in description or just type in webifiedhub.com slash send win. And uh, after doing that, we'll need to install a Chrome extension. But before just installing the Chrome extension, we would have to uh, sign up for send win. This is a free service, but if we would need uh, some premium features, then we would have to pay some bucks, but it is not that much. I am uh, I would prefer using premium version, uh, but uh, the free version is also good, okay? so. Uh, after going to their landing page what you just have to do, do is just have click on uh, register and here enter your name your email address enter your password and you can also book a, a, a demo with Sandwin or uh, and here in refer code just type in Khadeen to get special discounts and offers and uh, I, as I will be your referral, uh, uh, so uh, I might get some value from it. But uh, you can also get a lot value from it if you, you type there Khadeen, okay? And after doing that, you just have to click on register and uh, you will receive an email and uh, you can just um, blast, okay? So you, uh, you will uh, just receive a verification email and you just have to go there. But I have already signed up, so I'll just click on login and I'll just log in with my previous account. So here I'll not, I'll not, I'll now pause the video because I just don't want to show the password. So here I have entered the password and email. I'll just click on login. And here you go, here is my dashboard. Here is the Sandwin dashboard. This is a pretty simple dashboard. You have a billing and subs uh, subscription section, upgrade section. At the end, I'll tell you that how to uh, get a free upgrade and how to get some discount and what are the benefits of the upgrades. But right now, I'm just telling you about the free. So after uh, doing that, after signing up, here's also a affiliate section, by the way. And uh, uh, you can just refer it to your friends and get the pro version for free uh, for one month or two months or you can check the promos okay so after uh, going there just click on that uh, install chrome extension and just uh, install this chrome extension and if you are on the edge microsoft edge you might get that microsoft edge extension you can also install that but uh, chrome is mostly used so i uh, i'll always recommend chrome and just click on pin and uh, here you have this chrome and now what you just have to do is just go to your facebook account and after going to your facebook uh, go to facebook.com and now what you just have to do is you just have to uh, save this session and then you can log in with this uh, session from anywhere okay so how to save this session uh, you just have to click on this one and after clicking on this one uh, this sandwich uh, uh, section just click on stored session and uh, in stored session here you name this account my account username is Khadeen Akbar online you can name it uh, anyway uh, but I'm just uh, only naming it uh, for the sake of uh, you can say uh, just remembering it and just create a group uh, I'll okay, name it I'll name it FB and I'll just click on add so here you can see here it is added now here enter your uh, username and password again and just click on log now after logging in is it is asking me for uh, two-factor authentication because I have enabled two-factor authentication so I'll just click on continue and uh, after clicking on continue um, it would ask me for uh, approve using another computer or phone so I'll just click on continue again and uh, after clicking on continue again I'll just uh, again click on continue and sorry I just have to uh, accept it so now here you can see after logging in I am into this account but the uh, main uh, point of this video is how to use different account in both these two like one account there and one account there so how to do it let me just log out and log into another account so I'll just go to um, I'll just go to uh, switch accounts 
and uh, I'll just log it out and after logging it out I'll just uh, select an account from here so I'll just select this one and I'll just click on login and sorry uh, it is not getting logged in let me just go to another account so I'll just go to this account and after going to this account here you can see this is the account and uh, in uh, there you go so in this account what I would be doing is uh, that I would be going to this one uh, send win again go to store session and I'll just name it as uh, account to and group is Facebook okay so group is Facebook and click on add and here I'll again I'll again have to add these login details and after adding these login details and now here you can see I am able to sign in into this account. so here you can see it's the first account so uh, we'll just what you will just do is we'll just switch the account and I'll just go to this account uh, we can do with alternate method we can just go there and just go do that but I'll be doing uh, from here so here I'll ha have to add the password and I'll pause the video so now after adding the password I'll just click on login and uh, it would uh, didn't require so here you can see uh, here we have uh, uh, one account and here we have another account let me just again give you a demo and uh, I'll just go there and uh, after going there I'll just go to sessions other sessions and here you can see this is account to session and I'll just click on this one and uh, after clicking on this one and here you can see whenever you will click on this one so you will get an other account signed in so in same tab we have one account this one and one account is this one so that's how you can use sendwin and one more thing that there is not a limit of uh, just two accounts you can add as much accounts as you can and uh, you just have to store the session and after storing the session you just have to go there and you can just go to the website and you can just use it okay and one more thing that is it is not just for Facebook you can also do it for Instagram YouTube or any other social media platform you have some settings uh, step here uh, if you want to change the tab title or turn or uh, turn off sync and you have a lot other settings assign auto uh, proxies automatically if you want but it is a plus uh, subscription uh, required so let me just tell you about the plus subscription also so by the way here are their pricing plans in their free plan you can sync between devices and uh, uh, multi-tab isolation and session sharing you have free uh, you have it for free uh, but in pro <coughs> in pro plan what you have is uh, everything from pro uh, uh, free plan and then you can do it for commercial use like you are an affiliate marketer or any agency or anyone you can just do it and then you have a proxy support also if you want to add proxy to avoid blockage etc you can also uh, bookmark sessions and also what you can do is you can just uh, 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 bulk create sessions you can d just do uh, some stuff in bulk if you are in marketing I think uh, this uh, plugin w is going to be awesome for you and then you have this pro plus uh, uh, pricing plan uh, pr uh, sorry package uh, which includes all uh, in which you have one click all session share in uh, one click you can share the your session with your team members you can blur the sessions uh, you can uh, do a website session access and you can also create a session link like uh, if uh, if you want someone to access your uh, Facebook account uh, so what you can do is you just can you share the link uh, to uh, to that person and that person can uh, access that account from that link so that's how much uh, like uh, uh, useful it is and if we'll talk about its use cases we'll go, go to use cases and uh, here you can see for affiliate marketing digital marketing price retail comparison and a lot other ads buying etc you can just check it you can just go to link in description to ch check it and uh, I think uh, uh, th this is all about the video and if you like the video uh, hit the like button and if you uh, have any question you can just comment down below and uh, also if you need any services regarding digital marketing web design or SEO you can just hire us uh, we, uh, I'm running a web design agency and digital marketing agency and uh, so that's all about the video see you in the next video thank you so much